London at Dawn is a, it's just a magical time. My name's Anthony Epps. I'm a photographer. I've been in London now for 15 years as a professional. My name is Diana Epps and I work with my husband, Anthony. Wouldn't it be nice to have a whole series of books um, based around shooting at dawn? You know, images at dawn, and we think, God, that would be really beautiful. And um, really what we were trying to do was to show people how incredibly beautiful, how incredibly peaceful, how incredibly empty their cities were at dawn. Usually I don't really kind of have a, a set place to shoot. I just kind of like go around and follow the light. If the light's pretty, there's always something to shoot. So here we are at Tower Bridge. Um, this is such an iconic spot, it's so beautiful. I'm trying to frame up a shot here, but I don't think I'm exactly the right spot. I know Big Ben is uh, getting warmer, totally changing the color. Should I wait another minute? So what I've learned over the years is you always have to be ready because it could be literally 20 seconds of good light. One minute ago, I wouldn't have had any of the gold reflections in the windows. He notices things that I think you know, most of the world just don't, because it really makes me realize how much I need to stop and pay attention to the world around me. Today we're getting our F and Gs, which stands for folded and gathered, and it's the color proof of the book. Today I find out if I get it right or wrong. I'm feeling really nervous because we've never done this before. I've never been through the process of printing a book. I don't even want to think about what would happen if when we open the proof it's wrong because we would lose all of our money that we have paid for the printing. There's always potential for disaster. If it color is wrong, I, I, I screwed it up. Nobody else is to blame but me. You ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see Okay, and... That's too light. Yeah, that's all supposed to be oh, no. silhouetted. My, my initial reaction when I first opened it up was, um, they're not quite right. Everything's washed out. When we opened up the proofs, I just, I felt really underwhelmed. I mean, I, I'm so used to printing on inkjet and lambdas with the lab, and it's all kind of RGB-based portfolio, you know, even for my clients, it's all RGB-based, uh, and send it to them, and then they would take over the printing. But to get the prints back and go, oh, wow, that's really off. I'm feeling pretty excited. Tonight's the night. Yeah, this is a, this is a grueling painstaking project, I mean, my God, years in the making, and, uh, you know, it's finally come to this point, and it's um, almost over, and I think it's perfect. I think the exhibition is absolutely perfect. Um, so the whole purpose of this evening is to launch up a new publishing venture. You know, it's, this is it. This is what we've been working on for the past two years. Thank you, everybody, for coming. Um, this is uh, the launch of Cities at Dawn Publishing. I was, I was talking, I was laughing, I was signing books, I was seeing people I haven't seen in years, and you know, family was there, friends was there. Has it all been worth it? Of course it's been worth it. My family is happier than we've ever been.